What's up everyone, Leon X here, and welcome back to another tutorial. So I've been getting a lot of requests uh, lately for some um, uh, lives and continue uh, mod files for uh, this game Final Fight LNS Ultimate. And pretty much, um, I'm just going to give a tutorial on how to do this because um, <laughs> it's been kind of hectic with all these... Um, request uh, sending the mod files through email so I'm just gonna just show everybody how how to do this so um, let's see uh, first of first of all pretty much uh, if you're asking why am I doing the uh, lives and continue mods for this game well it's because everyone including me uh, we're finding it really hard to complete the normal mode which <laughs> I can't really even say if this is considered normal where you only have what uh one life and no continues so yeah that's yeah that's uh, <laughs> i can't really say that's considered normal difficulty so yeah so for those of you who really want to um kind of just edit this uh, mode you know this is a tutorial for you okay so first things first you want to download the game from the website the um FFN LNS Ultimate uh, Firebase app.com. Go to their site and you may get a pop up of the translation and translate to whatever language you prefer. Pretty much for me, English. Now, once you download everything, uh, including the uh, the bore pack compiler and extractor, uh, just make a folder and just you know, just drag the, the game and everything else in here. And then that uh, bore pack, the extractor compiler, you either open up with WinZip or 7-Zip. You wanna drag everything into the packs folder. The packs folder should have the Final Fight uh, LNS pack. And once it's in there, you wanna go to the extract bat. You wanna click it, right click, go to edit. Now you see uh, this part here, it says RV2. You can change this too. Uh, I just found out that um, this uh, will just take no more than like, pro probably like three or four letters. So I always go like FFLNS. Okay, so make that like five five letters. Pre pretty short where uh, you can't really space. And then you wanna go to file, save, close it. And then you want to name the rename this. Oops, you want to rename this to FFLNS. Okay, so once you got that down, just hit the extract and let that thing run. And I'm totally gonna edit this out. I'm pretty sure you guys do not want to watch this. Okay, so once that's done, you should have a data folder now. So how you edit the the lives uh, and it continues. You want to go into the data folder, then you want to go to scripts. Now you want to look for the this part here, join one, two, three, and four. Now depending on like if you have four people that you know you're gonna play with, you have to edit everything else, uh, all one, two, three, and four, and also the level C uh, script here. So how you edit is you want to go uh, just for example, click on join one C. You want to right click go to edit so this is how it, sh uh, it should open a notepad and this is how the code looks like so pretty much you want to look for uh, the, the hard mode uh, that has like an e uh, two equal signs and a zero this is pretty much uh, the easy level which is I think baby mode or whatever I think or just easy mode so yeah this is where you edit the the lives code so hard mode uh, uh, two here is normal and then I'm assuming um, the whatchamacallit uh, oh I'm sorry I'm sorry I take that back hard mode uh, one is normal okay so this somehow affects uh, both the hard mode and ultra hard I think and then uh, hard mode uh, two here is the uh, m m musu? I think that's how you say it. And yeah, that this is where you edit the the lives for the 
the Musu level. And, and hard mode one is normal, ultra uh, hard mode and ultra hard. So yeah, so this is what you wanna do. Uh, so actually we'll, we'll go with normal since uh, we everybody wants to play normal and we all know that. Even though it's normal, it's pretty hard due to the, due to the um, to the limited lives and no no credits at all and no continues. So I usually just edit this part here. Two, uh, we'll we'll make it mm, we'll make it four, and then the credits part will go like six, and then also. I think you also want to edit this. I don't know what this is for, but usually I'll give this a dash one. It's kind of like a a counter. Uh, so like when you die and you continue, uh, it will actually count down. So it will be five, four, three. I think if you don't edit this, then it'll just stay as like six. I don't know if it actually count down or it's like unlimited continues. So that's how pretty much this is how you edit the lives and continue uh, mode so once you do that we're gonna test this out oh and uh, let's see uh, just for the heck of it we'll edit this too we'll go uh, four and four and two actually let's make this We'll go two and two. Oh, actually, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's just go four and two. <laughs> okay, so once you got that down, save. So now this is just for the first uh, first player only, and you may want to do uh, for the rest of them same thing. And then uh, next is level. You want to edit that. So you want to look for the same thing, hard modes. Uh, which is yeah like two I think that's like Muso so you want to look for where is hard mode one uh, I think oh this might be it oh no 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 I'm sorry right here so you want to uh, edit edit this it was what we you set it to four and six, right? Okay, say so, you no. Know, let's uh, change. I mean, let's save it. Shoot, what's my call it? We might as well just edit this too. No, 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 forget it. We'll just, yeah, just normal. Okay, so once that's done, just save, uh, close out. And then, once we got all that done, uh, you just want to compile the whole thing back. So you go to Make Pack. Uh, first, edit, right click and then edit, and then make sure it's FFLNS. And then save and close. All right, and then, uh, yep, just hit that make pack and say yes to override the original. So pretty much whatever we edit on the data folder in there, uh, it will actually compile that data folder back into that uh, uh, game, game pack, the Final Fight L LNS uh, pack. And so we're just gonna wait until this is done. I'm gonna edit this out. All right, so once that's done, you see this uh, FFLNS pack? Rename it back to Final Fight LNS. All right, so then after that, just run the game. All right, so let's get started. And let's check this out. Now hopefully it will be...
Okay, well, looks like it works. So there's three, or well, four, <laughs> four lives. That's shown on the normal difficulty. All right, so let's try to see if we, if the, the credits work, continue. There you go, credit six. So, yep, we can still continue. So, yeah, looks like it works. Now, I haven't fully tested this whole entire thing out throughout the whole game, so I don't know. There might be bugs and stuff like that, but yeah. But at least we know that works. Okay, so, well, yeah, there you have it. There you have the, um, the lives that continues mode. So now um, there's other things too. I'm not done yet. There's uh, other edits you can do. Uh, for instance, you can uh, let's just say you can change the the characters' uh, stats and things like that. So let's head on over, and I'll show you guys where to uh, edit that too. Okay, so here's another. Um, another I guess I guess we'll just call it cheats like if you don't find the lives and continue um, editing uh, uh, you're still not satisfied with it you can go to the, the uh, data folder and you can go to the characters folder players and choose the players that you want to edit so for instance we'll go with Ken um, let's see. You want to go to the Kins folder and go to the Ken text. Open that up, and you can edit their uh, their health, their MP, their jump height, jump speed, and the gravity, and the invincibility. So pretty much, let's just say, if you feel that Ken is just way too weak and you want to up his uh, health. Where he has a good amount, <clears throat> good amount of health, uh, so he doesn't take too much damage. You can edit that, and the MP, the original number was a uh, hundred, right? But then you can bump that up too if you if you feel like you really want to bust out all those special moves and the supers. Yeah, just make it nine hundred, and it will come out as nine hundred or some. Or if that's still not enough. You can change the MP rate. Uh, the refresh rate uh, for the regular Ken was just like three, but now you can make it like 200 and it will instantly refresh that uh, MP uh, bar like nothing. It's pretty cool. And now, like the speed and jump speed, running, jump height, things like that, you can change those too. If you want uh, Ken's movement, regular walking speed to go as fast as possible you know I haven't tried uh, bumping up too high but I think like with 50 and things like that that's that's yeah, he's pretty quick just uh, his walking speed then the running this is uh, the, the the speed running type and yeah he's super fast just like the flash and then the other numbers here I think are the directional uh, speed part but I think five is just great enough for for the control when you run around the jump speed pretty much yeah you guessed it yeah uh, it's just pretty much his uh, I, I'm not sure if it's the how far he can jump I, I guess I don't, I don't know uh, there there are times where I I don't I don't I don't know I didn't play around with the jump high and jump speed but I think jump high he jumps really super high and I add that with the gravity holy crap <laughs> you get some really interesting um, uh, results with uh, with everybody's like jump jump height and jump speed so try it out yeah and then the uh, invincibility pretty much yeah if you want the the rise invincibility where when somebody knocks you down now you, you can't use that counter attack where you push up and attack when you we get juggled but uh, let's just say just let's uh, one, one enemy knock you down where, where you don't use the the counter attack you just let your character fall and get back up and he has like a minute 
uh, of invincibility. Well, you can uh, change that. I don't know if this is going by seconds, but I just I just play around with it. So with just 500, uh, I guess seconds. Yeah, that uh, he will he will blink invincibility for quite a while. And yeah, so yeah, if you feel like uh, the uh, the lives cold and continues. There are just uh, not enough. Well, you can use these and you know just play around with and it. You can and now just save and then uh, try compile compiling this again. Now, yeah, the thing about this is whenever you edit uh, something in the data folder, you have to compile it back with the make pack folder. So yeah, you have to change this back to FFFLNS. And then go to make pack and yeah just make sure you make pack go to edit and just make sure yeah it's, it has that on the on the edit part and just run it and just let this run again that's it and yeah for those of you who uh, are interested in coding and things like that or want to change the performance of the game yeah uh, please do share uh, what you find when you guys play around with this yeah the only the bad thing about it is yeah right after when you change it just remember you have to compile it back to the get uh, to the game pack uh file so yeah that's the that's the other part yeah it's really really uh um <laughs> it's really annoying but that well that's how you get the game to work but yeah so i hope you guys enjoy this tutorial uh please remember to subscribe comment share and like the video and if you can, do support the channel. There's a PayPal Streamlabs link on the video description below, as well as my Facebook and Twitter. And I will see you guys next time on another game or another tutorial. Have a good day, everybody.